Thanks, Jimmy. Guys, how you doing, Andy? I'm good. Happy St. Patty's. Oh, Arg. yeah. It's the day when people feel compelled to come to Manhattan and scream. Right, right. They're just all on the way to work, just people left and right. Arr! On every corner. Andy, Who are they yelling Andy, you at? just woke up half our oh. viewers. <laughs> Well, <laughs> right now they're like, oh, those two. Uh, <laughs> no, it is amazing how these people, most people out there, and especially in New York, you mm -hmm. go to Ireland on St. Patrick's Day, I think they go to mass and they have a nice meal and they right, right. give thanks or something. So it was, it was uh, Americans that turned it, it, New Yorkers that turned it into this thing. Yeah, yeah. Paint your whole body green. <laughs> Throw stuff. <laughs> and at noon, hit the guy next to you as hard as you can. Yeah, yeah. A fine tradition. Uh, well, I wanted to do something special uh, for the St. Patrick's Day show this year. It's something I've wanted to do for a long time. So um, I, about two weeks ago, traveled to the old country. I went to Ireland, and I brought a camera crew with me. And uh, it was really exciting. It was thrilling. And, uh, well, folks, here's what happened. Enjoy. <laughs> Well, I'm here, folks. This is Ireland, County Limerick. Beautiful place, just fantastic. It's good to be here. Now, it's very customary for Irish Americans to come back to Ireland, try and find their roots. That's what I'm doing. I've done some uh, research, and I'm gonna go out and try and connect with my past. <laughs> Hi, what's your name? Patty. Patty. Patty how Manning. are you? Conan O'Brien. Nice to meet Conan, you. Conan, how are you? Yep. Yeah, I'm, um, I'm in Ireland and I'm trying to find my relatives. Uh-huh. And I wonder if you could help me. Maybe you know somebody that uh, is related to me. The last name is O'Brien. O'Brien? Yeah. A lot of O'Briens in Ireland. Where are they from? I don't know. Just sort of the Ireland area. Yeah, big area. They ate a lot of meat and yeah. potatoes. And he had a head that was kind of big. First name? It was like Sean or Patrick or... Uh, what county? It was a plate that was very green. Freckles, um, prone to depression. And um, he, liked, he liked to drink. Is, that, is any of this helping? I'm going to show you some pictures and you tell me if anybody okay. looks familiar, okay? This was... Um, this right here is my... Was my those are my two great-great-uncles. That's a farm that they owned. They grew nothing. This is my great-great-grandmother right there on the right. Does she look familiar at all? Anyone that might look like her? This is my father when he was a young man. His name is Augie. Those ears were surgically altered later on. Those were uh, a bunch of my cousins on the day that they all married each other. They all mar got married to each other. And my breakfast first. I might have a toast after. Did this one? I did. I feel fine. Sound bad? You just. Uh, she's what? She got drunk. She's there now. She could be able to take it. Yeah, and I would trap it up. Buy my drink, and that's it. I'll get trapped up. That wasn't a sentence. I got the house set. The house set. Yes. For the brandy. Well, hit the hot now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this was my great great grandmother. Oh, jeez. How would I recognize her? You don't think she's pretty? No. No, she's all right. What's, what's your name? O'Halloran. Oh, Halloran, so there's an O in front. Yeah. That means we're related, right? Possibly. He's my <laughs> An O, come on. <laughs> O'Brien and O'Halloran, right? <laughs> we're all, we're coming in here. God, this is good. Yeah. So, can I borrow some money? <laughs> Are there any O'Briens in town? There's Petty O'Brien. Would you say he's a funny man? No, not really. Okay, so maybe we're related. One thing you'll discover in this country is that uh, in just about every Irish home, there's a picture of one of the Kennedys, which is uh, pretty cool. This is George from uh, the movie Airport 71. We're very privileged because the uh, Burt Reynolds of Ireland is sitting at the end of the bar right there. Take a look. Excuse me, I'll be right back. 
Ponds on the east side of the mountain where the rippling water flows. Where the rippling waters flow. Oh, you've got to have yourself a Guinness and you have to drink. Tell me, darling, in your letter, me. you'll ever... Be honest. You like newer stuff? They made up their minds and they started packing. They left before the sun came up that day. An exit to eternal summer slacking. John Denver. You like John Denver? Because I'm leaving on a jet plane. I don't know when I'll be back again. So I'm wondering, are there any O'Briens in your family? No. People like Chinese food here. Uh, yeah, like very much anyway. <laughs> do they ever ask for potatoes, french fries, anything like that? Yes. They do? Yes, they do. Do you serve it here? Yes, we're serving the chips here. This is very good. What do you call this? Chips. 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 Yeah. All right, let me tell you who I am. My name is Conan O'Brien. Can you say that? Conan O'Brien. Say it again. Conan O'Brien. Say King of Late Night. King of Late Night. That's right. That sounds terrific. I have a talk show in America. I'm on television, and I've a, I'm very, very famous in America. Big star. I have t-shirts here of famous Irish Americans, and I'm gonna show them right now. Do you wanna see these? This will help educate you. This is Daniel Patrick Moynihan. That's a famous Irish American. He's a senator. Do you know this guy? This is George Clooney. You know George Clooney? And then finally, this is the most famous Irish American. This is Shaquille O'Neal. Can you say Shaquille O'Neal? Shaquille O'Neal. Ian, I took you out of the class uh, because I think you look a lot like me. And I think uh, that one day you could be the, the next Conan O'Brien. Um, I'm not going to last forever. I've got another few years left in me, and maybe not even that. I'm clearly having a breakdown. Um, would you like to talk to celebrities someday and be a talk show host? Yes, sir. Um, you'd, you'd have to talk to... It's not all easy, you know? People like Charo, she's okay. But, uh, you know, Eartha Kitt sometimes. I mean, sometimes we don't get the best guests, and you're out there, just... It's rough. But you'd be okay with that? Yeah. Okay. Really? Eartha yes. Kitt? Yes. She's got nothing to say. <laughs> Okay, we're at the Cliffs of Moor. This is where O'Brien Tower is located. This castle kind of belongs to me, doesn't it? Sure, it belongs to all the Brian's, yeah. I'm going to go up there right now. Is it really beautiful up there? Oh, it's spectacular. It's spectacular. It's, yes, it's the highest point. In the I'm case. looking forward to this. I'm going to go up there and reclaim my heritage. Thank you very much, brother. <laughs> O'Brien Castle. This is my castle. It's up here on the cliffs of Moor. I have no idea why my ancestors abandoned it. They must have been idiots. It's beautiful. Who would leave this place? Hi. How do you like my castle? Do you like it here? Welcome. Welcome to my castle. Oh. Welcome to my castle! It's amazing! I'm back home! I can't believe I'm back home! Oh. It's a great day for the Irish. It's a great day for Ted. And as we go, we're singing, every Irish heart is singing. It's, it's a, a great day! day.
adorable. Those kids were great. All right, that was fun. We'll take a little break, folks. When we come back, we will continue the theme. Regis Philbin is here, the master.